Hi folks, Lund Pro Scott Glarvigan here. And one thing Lund Boat has been noted for, probably better than anything else, is their ability to catch fish out of their boats. And there's a reason for that. It's because how the hulls are designed to help the fishermen have better boat control in many different situations, whether you're from the bow of the boat, midship, or going back trolling. They accomplish that through hull design, and we have what's called IPS, IPS2, and IPS3. What I'm in right now is the Lund 219 Fiberglass Pro V boat. It has an IPS3 hull. It has a unique design to give you great performance and fishability. Also, Lund has the IPS2 hull, which is on fiberglass boats, the 189, as well as the aluminum boats. The IPS2 hull is designed off the IPS hull, which we originally designed back a number of years ago. Basically, the IPS hull was designed to give you a pad to give you lift so you get better hole shot, you get a, a faster ride, you get a drier ride because you ride on the pad that's designed into the hull of the boat. It's almost like a water ski. It gets you up and out of the water and it gives you lift. Consequently, it's a drier ride, a faster ride, a smoother ride, a more uh, economical ride because I'm, I'm not burning as much fuel. After they designed the IPS hull and the success that they had with it, whether you're going forward or back trolling, they created the IPS2 hull. That was a refinement on the Pro V's where they had integrated strakes at the bow of the boat, which actually brought more water under the, uh, the pad, drove it in the into the motor, giving you a faster, drier ride. The other thing that it did for you is because of the strakes, when I would drift with the wind, the boat drifts very, very square to the wind. Uh, those strakes catch the water so the nose isn't drifting downwind as you drift a spot. If I'm back trolling, those edges allows me to stay on the spot on the spot as I back troll with the IPS2 hull on the aluminum boat. The other thing, if I'm contour trolling going forward, whether I'm on my kicker motor or my electric trolling motor, those edges allow me to present the bait exactly where it needs to be where those fish are. It's almost like the sharp edge on a skate blade. I can track contours. As walleye fishermen, we know how important it is when we're fishing structure to make sure our baits are in the right spot and we're fishing the right structure and the right techniques to catch those fish. And a lot of time, it's because of the boat. We're using the boat, whether we're back trolling, drifting, or going forward to present the bait. If you have the best haul on the water, odds are you're gonna probably have the best presentation when you're out there trying to catch walleyes on those structure spots. If you're considering buying a boat, I encourage you to look at Lund boats and look at the IPS hulls and what they'll do for you as an angler.